get nervous, man. <laughs> oh. Hey guys, uh, hope all you guys are doing okay. My name is Ricky Nelson. Now, with Women's Day around the corner, um, I thought that I'd take this opportunity to celebrate uh, the special woman in my life and at the same time <laughs> entertain you guys. So, yeah, for those who do not know, uh, yes, I'm, I'm, I'm married, yes. I think three years, oh, fuck, I, said, I, don't, I don't even know how long I've been married for. She's gonna kill me for this. But anyway, she knows, she keeps the data for us. Like when we are out and people ask those kind of questions, I just look at her because whatever answer she gives is what we are going with. I'm not gonna contradict her, I'm not gonna say anything. <laughs> with, um, let's first talk about uh, to married folks for a while. Like, um, if I'm to ask you, what's, what's the biggest way? What's the biggest way that uh, the woman in your life has changed your life? Okay, what's, what's the biggest way? Uh, a lot of you have a lot of different reasons. But you know, <laughs> the, the most impact, there are a lot of things, but the most impact that uh, my wife has had on my life is something so trivial, uh, but it's, it, it's towels, man. Yeah, towels. Because I remember, I remember in my bachelor days, man, I had one towel. As in that was it. I had one towel. As in like I used it and when I felt that, you know what, um, <laughs> I think this thing is dirty now and I have to wash it. When I washed, I had no other towel, so I just had to tingiza myself like a doggy when I come out of the shower. But nowadays, man, I have towels. I have, I can actually wash towels like uh, every three days and I still have more to use yes that's when she is such small things that mean so much to me <laughs> another thing uh again for those of you who don't know i have a little girl my girl is about two years now that one i know it's gonna get me in problems for not knowing her and knowing this one but we'll survive so uh i remember uh, when they were, when she was growing up at the time, you was, it's just beautiful and it's lovely and all, all that is good. And then she gets to that age, like right now, she's at that age where she's just a menace. I, I did a special a couple of, <laughs> a couple of weeks ago, and uh, I called her a little shit a couple of times, and people called me out and asked me, Ricky, why are you calling your daughter a little shit? And I would like to take this opportunity. To apologize for that um i didn't i didn't mean it back then okay um i'm very sorry as and i shouldn't have called my little girl a little shit but i would like to state this categorically right now oh yes i mean it my daughter is a little shit as in she is just me in a small container that's all <laughs> and i remember yeah one thing you should know is we I, I we discipline our daughter we don't i'm not saying that we plow her through a wall no but we discipline her to teach her right from wrong and i remember in the beginning uh when i had my little girl cry it used to it used to pain me so much it used to hurt me and i used to go and uh get kind of mad at my wife and ask her why why are you beating her what has she done and no matter what she tells me no, no matter what she says even if i know and it's very clear that it was my daughter's fault i'll still take my daughter's side <laughs> and with that moving forward like nowadays nowadays i could be in the living room and i hear my little girl cry okay you first hear that you know the effect and then you hear the scream and I'll, I'll not even move a muscle man as in because i know my daughter's a little shit and whatever she has been punished for she fucking did it okay yeah that's it i said she fucking i trust my wife with that <laughs> i remember she used to call me death old mom yeah yeah my mom my, my mom what the fuck my wife i was so protective of my little girl that i was branded the dental mom of the house but nowadays nowadays as in you could just hear boom and i'll just be fine as in it's all good because one she is being taught right from wrong and two <laughs> she deserved that shit. <laughs>